So some of you might be wondering why I'm sitting in the 34 today, but today it is off to its new home. Uh, I'll explain a little bit more about that in a bit, but I'm just going to let it warm up and we're going to let it up here in the trailer. Talk to you guys in a bit. Before I got a new home, see my one of my other projects that I really should work on someday in life, but I won't. Maybe it looks pretty shitty right now. Been sitting around for like ten years, but maybe one day I'll actually work on it. Then again, maybe one day I won't. But yeah, R34 has a new home. Picking up the new project. And uh, I'll show you guys a little bit about that when I get home. See you later. Okay, well, to finish off my story yesterday, which I forgot to film a little bit more, but um, I decided to put the Skyline in storage because it was pretty much done. It's got to go back to the dyno, but not much to do with it right now. So I figured I'd set it, let it sit and wait and I'll get started on something fun for the summer and maybe get it done so I can drive it in the summer. Uh, anyway, I had my Red Civic last year. I got an opportunity to buy this car and basically part of the whole red car out, scrapped the shell, and now I've got this. It's a little dirty, but, and needs an engine, which is fine because there's one right, right there. Uh, this is a 2000 Honda Civic SIR. It's a, yeah, I don't know how much to say what it. it had a B20V in it, and it was taken out when I bought the car and sold to somebody else, which will come into play later. It went to a good friend of mine, so that's fine. 
Um, but yeah, it's kind of got. Let's see if you can see. Like, it's dirty as shit. I gotta put my wheels on it. Um, but it's got everything I kind of wanted in a car. It's got a full interior. I just need seats. Which is perfect because I'm a large person. Uh, there's the header for the motor, which only fits on this car because it's got a V band on it. But interior's nice and clean. I've got to fix some things. Um and put my seats in but pretty clean so we're good there and it's got a stereo in the trunk which may or may not stay because i've never had a stereo and not sure if i want one um and my favorite part of the whole car is this it's got well wood brakes so yeah, that's why the Skyline went back to the storage, and um, this is going to get worked on for the next little while. But I'm going to get to work here, and I'll catch you guys up later. Okay, so I've got most of the parts off the car that need to go back to people. Okay. Uh, unfortunately, my wheels, those black ones, didn't fit on the... They fit fine on the back, which, well, I mean, fine is relative, they fit on the back. But they didn't clear my favorite part of the car, which was these. Uh, so, it was nice that I have some upper control life too. I didn't realize that when I bought the car, but I'm excited. So these are going to be fun. Four pissing wheel woods are going to stop a lot, which means, unfortunately, those little tires are not going to suffice. So, I think these wheels and tires are going to end up going to my friend Josh, because he wants to put them on his EF, or at least try them. And then I'm going to see if I can find some more... Or some bigger wheels. So probably like 16 by 8 or 17 by 8 or something like that. And put some 245s on them and get some stopping power up front. Anyway, that's the new car. New project. Made some good progress with it. Ripped a whole bunch of stuff out that's not mine. And yeah, let's get start. So, we'll talk to you guys later. Uh, if you guys have any questions or ideas on what... I should do with this car as far as like wheels tires whatever let's hear them got a motor coming it's already there i've already started it i'm just waiting for the head to come back from the machine shop and then i can put that back together so we'll talk to you guys later